Poppers, my name's Shandy, and I'm so excited because today we are going to go on a you know tour of IGT and learn lots about pick lines. My co-host today is Iman. Hello! <laughs> and we're going to go down to the IGT in a couple of minutes, but I have a couple questions for you, Iman. Have you ever had a pick line before? Yes, I've had two. You've had two? Oh my gosh, so you're a bit of an expert. <laughs> I guess the nurses downstairs are an expert. Maybe. Maybe they yeah. know a little bit more than we do. <laughs> Amon, do you, do you know anything about pick lines? Yeah. First of all, it doesn't hurt. Mm -hmm. And you don't need to get a poke every day for blood work. They just do it out from your line. So that's really easy. When they like do it from your line, does that hurt at all? No. You do don't you... even feel it. Oh, you don't even feel it. Yeah. Wow. And then when you didn't have the pick line? What was that like? You had to get a poke every day and needles and no, no, no that's no. not fun. <laughs> lines. And do you remember getting both pick lines? The first one I remember, mm -hmm. I was awake for it, mm -hmm. and one of the trilight specialists was with me, and well, I was awake for it. So then they they were working on my arm over here while I was playing on like the iPad and what. And how long did it take them to to get the pick line in? I don't remember, but I think it was about 40 minutes or so. Okay. And what was your job when they were putting the pick line in? To stay still. Okay. That's it. All right. So you stayed still. What about like sports and stuff? Were you able to like go to school with pick line? Well, I never went to school during mm -hmm. the time, but yeah, you can do sports. I did yeah. play soccer, basketball. It was easy. Okay. All Running, right. bicycling. Yeah. Okay. That's good. So you can do all those kinds of things, yes. right? Awesome. Hmm. Is, and if, if any of the kids watching are about to get a pick line, do you have any advice for them? Anything stay calm and go with it. Hmm. Stay calm and go with it. That is really good advice. And what if they're feeling like a little bit nervous? What should they do to help themselves? Hold on to a friend. That's a good <laughs> idea. That's a really good idea. Okay, I'm in Adea's room and she's got her sister here, Olivia. And and Adea, do you have a pick line? Okay, and you and I were talking the other day and you said you had a couple things you wanted to share about what you really like about having a pick line. What's that? Um, you don't have to get a lot of pokes for IVs and you don't have to get a lot of pokes for blood work. Was it hard to stay still? Um, a bit. So what did you do when you were staying still? Um, I went down with Sabina from Child Life, mm -hmm. and we watched a movie. What movie did you watch? Um, Ramona and Beezus. Oh, okay. I haven't seen that one yet. Mm -hmm. They give you some medicine sometimes if you're feeling a little <laughs> bit nervous. Were you feeling a little bit nervous? Yes. Mm -hmm. And so they give you some medicine, and did it help make you less nervous? Yeah. Oh, and do you feel it when they do blood work through your pick line? Nothing. <laughs> that sounds pretty good. Good. Okay, and what are you wearing? This beautiful piece of, of clothing. What is this? <laughs> like a A. <laughs> um a colorful sock. And so somebody here at the hospital was able to give you one of those. Did you get to pick like what style you wanted or they They just gave me it. Well it's beautiful. <laughs> Adea, can can we see your pick line? I call this the, the spaghetti noodle. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's thinner than a spaghetti noodle. Does it hurt? Mm -hmm. No? Bye. 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 